Hi, this is Jerry, and this is the Cereal Box Music Report. I've got my cereal box, construction paper, tape, markers. Now, I'm in the classical era, so I want to choose a composer uh, from that era, and I don't want to make it too obvious, like, say, Mozart, because everybody knows about Mozart. We'll do somebody a little more remote, let's say, Beethoven. So I'll get started, and I'll come back with, for, with a little progress. All right, I've got the, my cereal box covered with construction paper, and now the fun begins. Uh, I've done a little research, and uh, unfortunately I found that Beethoven only lived half his life in the classical era, and then I guess he and his buddies started the Romantic era, so he's out. We've got to get, but got to get something else, another topic, uh, something that's very classical, like an orchestra. So I think what I'm going to use now, something live and local, is the Dallas Symphony Orchestra. Because it's a, an orchestra that plays classical music and right here in the Dallas area. So you're going to like this. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to uh, get some paper, stick it on the report, uh, like along the side where the list of ingredients are of cereals. And I'll put uh, maybe the ingredients of the Dallas orchestra, the instruments. And uh, put, uh, you know, symphony flakes or something here on the front cover and make some uh, design. And this, is, um, and this is where we make it look like a, a cereal box. So it's going to be a lot of fun. Can't wait to get started. I'll be back in a minute uh, to uh, show you the progress. Wow. So I am getting a lot of feedback about the Dallas Symphony not having been around in the classical era. Well, who knew? You know what? I think the, the, the secret here is just don't tell so many people what you're doing. So here's what we're going to do. I'm going to go with that. Famous classical composer, Weber. Have you heard of him? Cool guy. He wrote one of my uh, favorite classical music pieces. It's opera, by the way, and it's the Phantom of the Opera. It's Andrew Lloyd Weber. So we'll go with him, see how it, see how it goes. I'll let you know. Ta-da! All right, the finished product. Isn't that so cool? Now look, uh, uh, Mr. Andrew Lloyd Weber. He didn't quite qualify to be in the classical era since he's still alive. So, went ahead to the fallback position. Got Mr. Mozart. And check this out. Let's see. Got a very flattering photograph of him. Uh, toy inside. There's not really a toy inside, of course. Uh, uh, I couldn't find any magic flutes to put inside. Uh, fortified. We've got some interesting facts. And what is that, a coupon on the bottom? How about a little biography? And free sheet music on the back. This is not illegal. I downloaded this on the web, up the web somewhere. Okay. Uh, too much fun. I uh, hope you'll have a good time with yours. Bye.